This choose-your-own-adventure survival story game is both artistic and enthralling. I didn't know what I was getting into playing this game and thoroughly enjoyed my few hours choosing which way the group should go and whether they should be adventurous or stealthy. You were a group of four individuals on a mission to find the legendary Dome of Domes to save the people of the Citadel. You head across an ashen world collecting firewood, food and health packs and bump into creatures and humans who may or may not be on your side. I mostly chose the route of diplomacy and trust, approaching strangers and helping anyone out no matter what side they stood for. You get choices such as going down a windy path or into a dark cave, and each route will offer you a different outcome. Should three of your party die, you will lose the game. This game is simple in that you only need to left and right click around the world, but there's logic to its gameplay. Each character has health, hunger, warmth and energy bars that deplete differently depending on the status of your character or the type of environment that they're in, and you can replenish them with a campfire which could attract unwanted attention. As you walk across different lands, the world before you changes, and so does your screen. As you enter a freezing tundra, ice starts to form along the edges of your view. If a few party members are injured, red blood splatters stain your vision. The red is striking against the grey world, a nice touch for this creative venture. With 34 possible endings, this game has massive replayability. Each playthrough takes around two hours, but with many options to choose from, you can see how the story arc could drastically change from one run to another. Released early in 2021, this game costs less than £10 and is well worth a look. Want some more games to while away the hours? Check out Virtuaverse and Pathway as excellent alternatives. Thanks for watching!